Hey everyone, uh, I'm really excited to share with you this new feature, uh, the ability to apply values to all descendants uh, with bulk actions. Um, so let me uh, explain the feature. Um, basically today, if uh, I'm looking at uh, the uh, items hierarchy, uh, whenever I apply a value uh, to the parent item, in this uh, scenario, the epic, um, it applies to the item itself, but the values are not inherited um, to uh, the children and the sub-children of the item. Uh, sometimes it can cause um, uh, data inconsistencies. When looking at a quarter, for example, uh, usually we plan the epics that go into the quarter and then we uh, bulk apply them to the specific quarter, or in this case, the release. Uh, but sometimes we didn't uh, apply the release value to all the children. And then when we look at the progress, especially if it's the all the group items, we'll, we'll see uh, that the progress doesn't calculate all the children because they are not in the group. We didn't assign them to the group. So to ease this process, what we did is now when selecting items, and applying changes in the bulk actions. So let's select release three and let's select importance and feature value. And I can decide if I want these changes to apply only to the items that I specifically selected or to all the item descendants as well. So if I toggle this on, the changes that I made will, will apply to the features of those items and the sub features, all the items descendant. And I apply. And now the changes will apply not only to the items that I selected, but also to all their descendants. So you can see they're all in the same release. They all have the same importance and the same feature value and it helps me align the data. So if I'm looking at Q, uh, release three, I know all the items are there. Um, this enhancement is supposed to save time and ensure data consistency, improve the progress uh, calculation, uh, and uh, maintain uh, accurate value alignment across all the related items. Um, we hope it helps you achieve a more efficient workflow. Um, thank you so much. Uh, we're waiting for your feedback.